All right, we don't give much time to the circle, okay, which is pretty interesting. It has a lot to offer us. And here's one example where I have a secant line, AK, and another secant line, NK, that meet here. Now, the theorem basically says that NK times KI will equal AK times KL. How can that be? Okay, so we're going to show this girl that we can do that one more time. We're going to join two chords, NL and AI. And then this arc in here is, can we call the arc, which gives me an inscribed angle and an inscribed angle. So inscribed angles on the same arc are equal. All right. This angle is common. So this becomes the key to be able to prove that the triangles are similar. So because we have two angles of one triangle equal to two angles of another, the triangles are similar. Therefore, the sides are in proportion. So we're going to take, we're going to take the side AIK and it'll match NLK. So if you go down to the bottom over here, we'll see how this works. Okay, so these letters all correspond. So we can say that AI is to NL and AK is to NK and IK is to LK. Okay, if you look at them and you cross multiply these two, I will get exactly this. Okay, if you want to check it, this times this equals this times this. There it is. And we have proven the theorem.